Okay, hello guys, it's Slack out here, and today we are here for the week number 5 of the AP Academy Season 4, where we are going up against 6 foot hacks, aka Leo, coach of the Durham Dradigas. They are scary opponent, they are good at the game, <laughs> and yeah, their content is fun. Definitely go check them, check them out if, if you haven't already, I don't know where you are, where have you been, if you haven't checked him out, especially if you are on this channel. Um, but anyways, um, you have the team up above, I'm going to get them the team as well here, so I can actually talk about it a little bit more, but the first co coach, top man of our team is Electivire, and that's uh, here for the circuitry they have, that's scary man, um, it can win games alone, now, if if it gets out of hand, it's just over. So this is here for with the AV um, Earthquake Wall Switch Thunder Punch Darkest Lariat. The Darkest Lariat is there for the Mesprit because offensive Mesprit can be a pain, and I want to be able to hit it hard as I can. I had I think Fire Punch here to hit Virisian and stuff like that, but I can just Wall Switch and go into my other stuff that can take care of Virisian better than this good. And then we have our Drampa here, um, with Calm Mind, Substitute, Flamethrower, and Dragon Pulse, um, with the ability Berserker Leftovers. So, the plan here is to, um, with Bangor or Parting Shot out on the Armatiers coming in, Kao into this, Calm Mind up, Calm Mind up again, possibly if, or Substitute. <laughs> It depends on uh, the spread, how how it goes, but yeah, we should be, let's say, Aromatis, let's put that level 50, then we have Jampa here, and we are at plus one, plus one, Moonblast is doing 33, if they are minus one, it's doing 21 to 27, so we can sub up with plus one and hope that it doesn't break, and we can calm it again, and then we can sub up again, and do that. Over and over again, and flamethrower should be two hit KOing uh, when we are plus two if it's physically defensive. Pretty much always, and plus three it's always a uh, hit KO, so that's nice. But that's like our setup fodder, and we can do that against Mesprit as well if we get parting shot on it or something else maybe. But this point of this is that Steelix comes in, we have Calm Mind up, and we flamethrower that and get it chipped down that way. Then we have our Pangoro here with Iron Fist ability and Rose Slippery again. Um, I didn't really feel like needing extra damage from stuff like Expert Belt. I didn't want Life Orb recoil, so Rose Slippery is here if they want to do some finicky stuff again with Mesprit. Or maybe we can tank a Moonblast from Aromatis, which is more unlikely to happen. We have Drain Punch, Bullet Punch, Knock Off, Parting Shot. We don't really need anything, anything else. Bullet Punch is there for Aerodactyl. It's generally good to have that priority here. Drain Punch and Naga hit most of their stuff. I don't hit... Let's see. I think I hit most of the stuff. I think I hit most of the stuff. Yeah. Either with Drain Punch or Naga. Except Aromatis, of course. But Bullet Punch can hit that as well, and we can party shot out. Do something else. And we have our Slurp, which is one of our win cons as well. After Steelix is chipped down, we are Citrus Berry Unburdened. Um... Player of Drain Punch, Thief, <laughs> and Belly Drum. So Thief is there to hit the Marowak if it comes. Um, otherwise, Player of Drain Punch should be able to play in the game pretty much. Like, defensive Skantan can take a hit, and I think Evil at Porygon can swill. But Xerxes shouldn't be able to take Player of any ever, and Aerodactyl with Focus Sash might take. Uh, or will, will take a hit if they have Sash intact. Then we have. Our Quillfish with Black Sludge, our Water Resist this week for the Clubitsch, and Intimidate to be able to switch into Aerodactyl with, from u and from Crobat or um, Budding Shot from Bangor. And we have Liquidation Poison Jab. We should be able to take Earthquake from Aerodactyl um, after rocks, two of them, so that's nice. And yeah, we have spikes if we want to click that, because they don't have the best removal, but I think Aerodactyl is going to have defog just because of these spikes. But if I can force them to defog one turn, that's really nice, so yeah. Then we have our 
cruel but modest nature, we have sludge bomb hit with U-turn, nasty plot. We got nasty bad this week. Um, this had a slash over U-turn at one point, but I thought that U-turn is just better. Early game, we have life up, and after nasty plot, we are pretty much breaking stuff. Uh, I think like max specialty and Steelix. Because Steelix is most likely the switch in for this. Let's see, Crobat. Heatwave of the plus two will one shot that after they have sturdy, of course. I think Steelix has that. So yeah, we have to think about that. We first like U turn or something. If they left those, then it's a little bit iffy, but what can we do? Hopefully, Trampa has shipped down that already, so we wouldn't need to deal with that. But yeah, that's the team, and we will see you guys soon with the game. And here we are for the battle itself. Whew, I'm excited. Uh, I again need to get my sleeping tool ready. Yeah, there we go. Okay. I don't actually know what I'm leading with. Maybe Crobat. They bring Shurgity, Aerodactyl. No armor piece. Okay, what's the... Switching for Pangoro, that's interesting. So, no armatis, I think they are leading Aerodactyl Oxirki. So maybe I'll just lead with Crobat. No, I'm leading with Wheelfish. Um, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm leading with Wheelfish for sure, because if they leave with Aerodactyl, they need to swap out. And I can get a Slay of Spikes up. And depending on what they go into, I can... I have switchings for everything. Eurasian might be a little bit hard to switch into, actually. I'll just hard swap into Pro, but maybe. Yeah. Yeah. Let's go. So I think Aerodactyl lead is very, very possible, but that's... Also, like the obvious one. I can see Klovice being the lead as well because that has U turn. I don't think Circuitry is a lead. If it is, they probably know that. Well, they should definitely know that they like is my answer for that. Midi tone, that's the Klovice. Okay, so I think they're flip turning or U turning here to see that if I'm Rocky Helmet. I don't think I would ever be Rocky Helmet against them. But I think I'm. Because if this is Pex, Dark Pulse will hurt. Let's see. Oh, it's uh, Pex, Dark Pulse does maximum of 85%. I think I'm forced to poison jab here. Even though Spice would be very nice, but I need to poison jab. Why do I do so little? Yeah, I'm poison jabbing. Dark Pulse is Specs. Not Specs, okay. Yes, that's fine. I think I'm pain splitting. We get hailed from whatever, I think. I should have checked the damage, but that's not Specs. We were at. 160, so that did like 70. Wow. 116 down to 62, that's... Oh, that's not... It could be Scarf. Maybe it's Teamit. Yeah, that's probably teammate damage. I'm... I was just swapping out. Maybe it's Scarf. Maybe it's Scarf. Two Dark Pulse Splinters is... In a row is quite unfortunate, though. So. Um, Dark Bulls. So how much would Skulls do if it's... Did... 8. 
No 18. No 17. I'm, I'm good. So that's less than max special attack teammate. Okay. I think I'm down to knock off though. Nothing really wants to take this. Maybe I'll train punch. I'll train punch because of the view is possibly being the check. Or oh, that's yeah, true. I don't think you should pick it that much. It did a lot. It's max speed teammate, I think. That's fine. That's annoying though. I'm not letting Bangor go, I can go let Quillfish go though. Uh, it's a bit annoying that I've clinched two times, but yeah, Aura Sphere is a move I should know. I literally saw that in my calc, but I didn't think about it. But it's not choice. That's like what we know. Is it like defensive? Because Bangor did like under half the train punch. Oh, I got a low roll from Brain Punch, that's possible, possible as well. Okay. Yes, yeah, sure. I'll just pain split in case. So I don't think that's uh, anything special on that bulk side, it's probably just max HP. Then I'll go into Electivire. And Thunder Punch. Maybe I'll hard swap. Let's see. I'm I'm thinking how I'm going at it at this game. I'm probably hard swapping into my Bangoro here. They might um, call this and stay in, uh, because they are fine sacking this, because it did so much already. Yeah, they're thinking it true for sure. Yeah, okay. This was first, Tangoro comes out. Okay, yeah, that's that's my thing. I'm getting molly what? Um, what I want? That's that's so annoying. That's so annoying. I was just Thunder Punch. <laughs> it's fine. They go into Steelix here. Yeah. Um, yeah. I don't have too much to touch this anymore. Because of that play. That's... That's a shame. But I think I'm going into my robot here and setting up Nasty Blood. So Mar Mar because Marowak is here, this cannot like do too much. They probably... Uh, what's the play to this? They don't have a play. Throw path into, let's say, Aerodactyl, of course, he just do like, too much. Am I fine just heat waving? I might be just fine heat waving. Because then I can 
I'll heat wave. I'll just heat wave. This comes out. I have a sludge bomb, so that's nice. This it should be killing this. Oh, maybe that's a no. That's not a. It could be AV. I didn't think about this too much. Could be AV. Yeah, it's probably AV. Ugh. Yeah, that's AV. That's a misplay. That's a misplay. But I think I'm U turning and not going into Trampa. I'll U-turn and go into Trampa. Tovision comes in at that point. Does Trampa take? Close combat, it doesn't okay. So what I'm doing here is I'm trying to get the Steelix in. I'm hard swapping into Trampa, I'm taking damage. And then I'm hitting something with flamethrower, hopefully the Steelix. And then I'm going to try and sweep with Benitra. That's what I'm trying to do here. Because it's definitely possible that I can win that way. So I'm playing to that win con because of how badly this match has gone for me. Um, Grobat. Healers, Blawich, and U-Turn, yeah. I guess so. That's... This, okay. I'm using my time, but I want to be sure... I don't actually take a hit from this. Does Trampa take two? Trampa doesn't take two player pitches. Um, that's a shame. Probat dies, and I go into Trampa. That's what I'm going to do. I'm sacking Probat. Marowak kills. Marowak kills. Probat. Leppage, and you are Rocket, probably. Let's see. You are Rocket, okay. I'm going into Tramba and I'm subbing up. Or am I? They don't need to, like, do too much. And they outspeed me. If if they outspeed me, they do 67 with Earthquake. That's 120. We have 35 HP. That's not enough for Sharp, is it? No. I'm thinking if I can win if I don't Sharp. I don't think I can. Do I need to take the maximum amount of damage here? That I can get. I think so. Um, you stay much just stay in a brick break low kick game. Oh, we die! What? Oh, that kills me from full. Oh. Yeah, yeah, it's over. 
Yeah, I should have gone into Electiva, I think. Yeah, I, I wasn't up to this game today, it seems it was complete. Ash from me. Oh no. I need to do it quick. Uh, yeah, this is a shame that this match had to go this way. Uh, Maybe we get it. Oh, we don't need a crit. Yeah. Team, go. Yoink. <laughs> we get a kill. Um. At least we got a kill with E. Let's go. At least. Then comes in Steelix and Steelix kills us in one hit. He should kill us. Um, heavy slam. He might not have heavy slam, of course, but yeah, it's most likely has. Dream punch. Who? That's that's damage. That's not max HP, or maybe it is. Oh crit. Okay. Let's go. We get a crit. We get a crit. Heavy slam by okay, GG, Leo. I'm ashamed that the match went that way. I first I didn't think about the aura sphere, then I didn't think about the low kick, and yeah, I I think let's see now back. Brick break wouldn't have killed, right? A brick break, well, let's see. Okay, Brick Break had chance to kill. Anyways, like that was stupid play from me. I should have gone into Electiva, then Slurp, but then I had Trampa still alive. Um, but yeah. <laughs> Thank you for watching. Um, next week we are up against... Who are we up against? We are up against Vancouver Titans. I, did, I believe they are coached by Gray. I, I think so. I think so. Vancouver Titans. That's great, yeah. Has to be. But yeah, we will see you guys next week for more APA Academy content. Hopefully, I don't botch the game um, as I did this week against Leo. Nevertheless, we will see you guys then. Bye.